What's up, guys? It's Kendra and Dustin, and we are back with another episode of Paper Lily. Now, previously, I got Medusa, but honestly, a lot happened, I think, in those past two episodes. You know, since he works with clay, I wonder whether we Medusa or were we encased in clay? Uh, good point. Which one's worse? I Probably feel the like encasing. In clay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Wait, was there mud in the garden? Or like dirt? I mean, there was. Yeah. Do you think that's where he gets his clay? I don't think so. Or do you think it was just disturbed? Because clay doesn't necessarily It's grow from the ground, flowers, right? right? It's like mud, but specific mud? Yes. Yeah. But as I said, it, cl I clay is not usually conducive to I'm plant not, growth. I don't very, I don't know. I'm not super familiar with soil. <laughs> 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 but yeah. So well, clay pushes water out, and that's why <laughs> we got encased. Then I like the word Medusa better, but I do well, I think mean, the encasing is probably <laughs> freakier. But anyway, we got turned into a statue, one way or another. So that's kind of where we're at. Um, you said so. W what are you sharing with the class? Well, I will notice things when we were when I was editing the the other episodes, mm -hmm, and so mm -hmm. the like you kept getting angry that it put us before you interact with him to yes. start the chase. Yes. Well, what if we're to supposed to use it. an item on him? Ah, uh, do we have an item? We do have the chips that put people <gasps> to sleep. Oh, you think you'd eat them? Oh, maybe. he's also got a hole in his head. So maybe mm, we could just pour them in. Hmm, in. possibilities. All right, so that's so where... a living pot <laughs> or True. kettle. Anything else that you need to share with the class? Well, then there is the one area where the last key is, but I, that kind of we requires Miss to look be at it. there. To okay, see. okay, okay. <laughs> so we got a couple different things that we're going to experiment with. I don't know how it's going to go because this fun, this game is amazingly fun, but it also makes you try out a bunch of things to see. Is this even an option? <laughs> so we're going to do that and we'll see where it goes. So... Here we go. Okay, so it stuck us right here. <sighs> okay, so you... so we could try running away again, but or we could put these in his brain or give them to him. I'm not entirely sure. Yeah, I don't know. Hmm. Let's try it. Need a chill out snack. You. Maybe he's hangry. Yeah, you're not you when you're hungry. <laughs> <gasps> oh, it worked! <laughs> it did something. Uh, uh, I guess. <gasps> he ate it. Whoa! It worked. I don't know how long it works. Should I interact with him? No. I kind of want to read what's behind him. He seems to be asleep. I'd rather, I'd really rather not bother him. But I want to read the paper. <laughs> There's a piece of paper. Wait, did I do this? I think so. Reach inside. I mean, yes. Well just... Nothing. Okay, that's what I thought. Fine. I guess I don't want to read the piece of paper. What can we do while he's knocked out? Can I move this? Did he disturb me moving this last time? I don't no, think I so. don't think so. But maybe we can look under better. Check under the drip. Yes. Because she was like, I don't want to. It's wanna... like an unfinished sculpture of a lady. She looks like she's made of porcelain. Okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Hmm. I don't know. 
maybe we leave the area and come back. You think he would? Oh, wait, do I have to? <laughs> you think he'd be better like after he takes a nap? Maybe. So just go outside. Your theory worked, Dustin, but now I don't know what to do. Okay, that's the same. Yeah. Music's different. It's interesting. Because hmm. each time we've done something, it's added a new element to the music. I don't know what to do. I mean, we have all of the interactions with the candle guy still, but I don't know if that would necessarily be the whole purpose of putting him to sleep, right? No, I don't think so. Okay, let's go check on him. Maybe he's awake. No. No, he's still asleep. I feel like that paper is important, though. Right, but... Because even if we hadn't put him to sleep, if we chased, he would either keep chasing us out of his house or he would just come back here, right? Yeah. Yeah, so this must be the right answer. But for what? But maybe now we need to get something to wake him up. Small art piece. What is this? I think it's a cat. I think I said that last time. Something to wake him up? Coffee. I don't know. Like I said, I don't know. Mm. <laughs> this feels like the right answer, but I, I just don't know what to do with it. Me in math class. <laughs> <laughs> this feels right, but I don't know what to do now. <laughs> I mean, hmm. maybe we go back to the other area. Okay. Everything sounds lighter, you know, like... Yeah, well, like yeah, I said, it added ooh. it added extra to the music. But I don't get what we did. <laughs> um, Red's house. You think we should go over there? Well, that's where, like I said, there was a thing I noticed. <laughs> and then we also just haven't been to Red's house yet. All right. You notice something over here? To the left. To the left. Left before the sign. Take it said. back now, y'all. Two hops this time. Uh, uh. <laughs> okay, down here? Yeah. Do you see? Do I see? Is there something in the darkness? No. Oh. What am I supposed to look at? What, do I, what am I seeing? There's a hard edge that shouldn't be there. Hard edge. What? Am I dumb? What are you talking about? Hard edge? Yeah. On like one of the trees? No. On a plant? On the ground. Hard edge. Hard Walk up. Edge. Now, look. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Okay, what am I looking at? Is it not supposed to do that? I mean, yeah, that's kind of weird, but... Look, see, the entire area yeah. has soft edges. But what is that like supposed nature. to mean? I don't get it. I'm guessing this is a carpet. Can I interact with it? Um... How do I... I don't... I don't know what to... I don't think I can do anything with it. Can't you interact with it? Oh! The f I was hitting. Okay, whatever. Why were you hitting E? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> the floor here is unusual. Is this the key? 
There's a key hidden here. Yes? That's it, right? Those are all the keys I need? That are, that is all the keys. There's a note as well. The note reads, what do you think? I think this is my best hiding spot yet. No one would search for something in plain sight. Yeah. Huh. So that's another thing that we're gonna have to pay attention to though. Texture! <laughs> okay, should we go up? I guess. I don't know what else we're supposed to do. Well. Whoa. Yeah, that's the thing is like, you know, I it feels like. Whoa. What? Our color changes. A strong lamp. There's a lot of stuff to do. Okay, listen. If that's not ketchup, I feel like this is a sign. You can be the voice. Oh, an interesting character appears. Ah, uh, whoa! You look interesting. Someone's there? Whoa, look at him. He's so cute! What, do you recognize him? No, I'm oh. trying to determine what the voice should sound like now. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody has come in a long time. I hope you can make it over here. I could try. One of your lanterns is out. Everywhere seems to, wait, what? A strong lamp. It's out, what are you talking about? Okay. Should I touch it? I feel like if I touch it, I'll die or something. Or like a shark will eat me or something. I feel like there's like a gap right there that's like a perfect square, so maybe we have to stand in that gap. Right where? Right there. Oh, you think we should stand there? We can try it. Oh. What? <laughs> I thought we were fighting something for a second. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. We're spike dodging. Move around to avoid the spikes. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Got it. Everyone dies there. Oh, well. I got you, dude. I got you. Try again. What's skip? Would that just put me in the spike spice? I don't know. Should I just hit retry? Yeah. I bet you it does. Alright, let's do this again! Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Ah! Dang it! <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> Is he going to have something different to say every single time? Should I just hit skip and see what happens? I don't want to... Mess something up? Yeah. traps here can I go or am I gonna run into the spikes again mm. okay whoa wait what whoa wait, what? <laughs> wait how does that work is that him I think so this is confusing. almost there what did I hit before? Did I always hit space? I think so. Okay. Be careful not to die. I'll try. I don't really get how this whole thing works. How much longer is this path? 
Only till you get there. Right. <laughs> okay. Shoot. Fudge nuggets. Do I have to be quicker? Maybe. Will you be okay? Maybe not. Uh, obviously not. Ooh. Just try again. This one? Yeah. Will it put me at the beginning? Okay. Yeah. Ooh, 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 ooh. Dang it! <laughs> you need to go down. I know! <laughs> you can't say it after it's done. The trick is to not touch the spikes. Everyone dies there. Oh well. Okay, I think we're at the end of the. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Aw, what? Okay. Move while it's yellow. If you can. I'll try. What? The, that was different. It, you do. It, no, you have to do in and out first, and then it starts following. And so, since it's always that top corner, you should try to end at that top I corner. I can try. Because <laughs> he said you almost had it. I'm guessing this is the last one then if his dialogue changed. Okay. Hey, you almost got it first try then. I'm not sure how I feel about the sax, but I guess I'll just talk to you. Hi! You made it! I did. 
You must be really good at dodging spikes. Sure. Thank you. He seems friendly. I don't know. <laughs> I'm surprised you're talking to me this much. Talking is an important means of communication, no? Well, yes, but... You talk as well. I do? But you're... What are you? What exactly are you? My name is Rune, and I like runes. Oh, I have a rune. Do you have any runes? Do I have any runes? I mean, I do. So, should I give it to him? I feel like yes. I'm gonna trust you, Rune. Yes, I do. Amazing! Please give them to me. I will give you trinkets in exchange. Ooh, what kind of trinkets? Okay. So, are you some kind of spirit? Not exactly. We've gone by many names in the past. But humans often refer to us as demons. Hmm. Okay. What is your name? I don't want to give it out. <laughs> <laughs> I know how this place works, okay? Fairies and demons, I'm pretty sure, are both the same, right? Names have power. Lacey! Oh, come on! <laughs> At least come up with a nickname like L or Savannah or I don't know, something. <laughs> Do you have a nickname that nobody uses? Do I personally? Not that I like. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, but that's the thing. Is yeah. That nicknames count usually. Oh, what if I don't like it and not a lot of people use it? Maybe like one or two people have ever used it. It counts, right? Like, as a name, but not like a name name. Anyway, Lacey. Miss Lacey! Uh, yep. Rare to see a human around here. How exciting. You are human, aren't you? Can you not tell? Yes, you can tell? A little bit. Is it the whole, like, the skin and the hair and stuff? <laughs> a little bit? Some of us have the appearance of a human, but it's easy to tell the difference with a real one. Ah. Uh, you, however... What about me? Even though you're a human, you smell a bit like... I smell? I can't speak of them, but it's someone very bad. <gasps> what? Who have I been around? Well, she does seem to think she's cursed. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe she is. <laughs> Maybe I am! <laughs> also, if somebody ever makes a plushie of this guy, let me know. Hit me up. He's adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Who is it? Look it up. <laughs> <gasps> it's a thousand years bad luck to talk about it. What? Please, I really need help. Um, I know that there's something off about me. I did this ritual to find out what it is and how to fix it. With this ritual? Okay, I don't know how getting on a bus would help me figure out what's wrong with me, but okay. <laughs> I see. For a moment, I thought I might be possessed, but... Oh. Nonsense. Possession is an outed... <laughs> Possessions are an outed... outdated concept. Then do you know what it could be? A curse! Ah! <laughs> what? 99% per... of illnesses here are curses. Here? Okay, then maybe. <laughs> what about the other 1%? What a silly question. There is no 1%. Uh, oh. So it's just a 100%? Do you know how I can lift this curse? 
Well, if we're dealing with like fairies slash demons, it is it is important to avoid absolute decisions. <laughs> Unless you're a hundred percent sure that it is a hundred percent. Whoa. <laughs> because if you're because it's the whole a half truth is a lie. And so if you say something is a hundred percent but it's not actually a hundred percent, then you're you'll lying? get in trouble. Then you're lying. Uh, I don't like the Harrys. <laughs> <laughs> you should seek red. Red lifts curses. Um, honestly, Rune, I kind of thought you were supposed to be red. Well, this is red. This is where red's house is. Tree yeah. house is. Supposed to. This isn't a tree house, though. No, it's a dock. <laughs> it's like the opposite of a tree house. Unless by tree house do they mean because it's made out of wood. Oh, at the fairies, man. <laughs> How can I find Red? Incidentally, this is Red's tree house. Yeah, I saw the sign earlier. I guess I should check it out. Thank you, Rune. You're welcome, Miss Lacey. He's adorable. You better not screw me over! <laughs> um. Okay, we kind of need to save. Yeah. <laughs> Do you th oh, okay, let's try going back. I don't... Th I'm guessing we won't have to do the so traps just run. again. Oh, uh, it won't let me. Mm. Well, we could just close it on this. I suppose. Yeah. All right. And that is where we are ending today's episode. Slightly different than before because it won't let me save. So we'll have to figure that out. Though I'm... Maybe if we closed it, it would just put us back here. I'm not sure, and I'm not to willing it. to risk it. Those spikes were annoying. Anyways, <laughs> so that's where we're ending for today's episode. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this series, because I know I am. It's so fascinating, because I really like... Fun music. It is. I really like, like, um, urban legends and stuff like that. Not as into, like, folklore in things you know like i'm not not into it i just haven't studied it or learned about it or anything like what that what is an urban legend but modern folklore yeah but it's like way different you know i feel like urban legends don't have as many rules in fact i would argue they're the opposite like they're constantly changing versus things in the past seem to be much more rule based like the whole you can't speak in a hundred percent and don't walk into a fairy circle or you'll get like thrown into a weird time loop or something. You know what whistle I mean? Underground. What? Don't whistle underground. Don't whistle underground. Though I've heard that you're not supposed to whistle in a forest at night, which is kind of like an urban legend. I also don't necessarily... I don't know. Anyway, I find this very fun and very fascinating because it's like a, a mishmash of a bunch of different things, it seems like. Because we had like the kind of more yokai kind of stuff on the bus but now this seems much more fairy tale based and we are in a forest and so well if you're doing like comparative folklore basically i mean yeah i guess and you're just like putting them in and it's like it's oh, fun if it's one thing yeah but then the story but they're all the same yeah because... yeah it's it's a lot of fun and i like it so i'm really excited to see where it goes if you guys are curious and you want to check it out for yourself there should be a link in the description below i highly recommend you check it out it's a lot of fun um if you have any fun facts theories or whatever feel free to drop it down in the comments down below we'd love to see you say hi what's up we always respond all we ask is no spoilers so if you've already played this game don't spoil it that would ruin the fun and nobody likes that nobody likes that uh if you do want to talk to us more you can always come to our live stream we live stream on twitch every monday wednesday and friday we don't stream this particular game we stream other games if you're curious about those we upload all of them over to our youtube channel which i'm guessing you're on so you can check out what we're playing before coming to a live stream Otherwise, you can just stay on YouTube. Like I said, we respond to pretty much any comments. So you can just drop it down below. You should check out the other games. If you haven't already, there is a prologue. Project Cat. It's quite different, honestly. <laughs> like, I feel it's the same, but it's quite different. Like, I feel like the mood is way different the whole time. 
Yeah, but she ends up in a different place. Yeah, it's quite different, but it's the same. Fascinating, really. Oh, that's all I'm going to say, but we will probably keep referencing it. So if you haven't seen it already, definitely check that out. But honestly, check out any of the games we have available. They're all pretty freaking entertaining. If you want a sneak peek of the various games, you can always go to our TikTok, our YouTube shorts, or our Instagram reels. I think that's it. Yeah. Sweet. Like, comment, subscribe, share, do whatever you feel like doing. We will appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.